Andy, pre-season is underway. Plenty of Everton values on show? Yeah, definitely. Um, not more so than probably yesterday's training session. Um, the girls have worked fabulously. You know, we, you've heard me say we were going to really set a, a real clear tone to how we wanted to do things in pre-season and so far you know we've we've delivered on that and it is a collective you know the staff have been brilliant as well so you know I've got to give a big acknowledgement to you know we've had a few changes in terms of physios and sports science and obviously Martin coming in as an assistant and they've been brilliant they've really driven from the staff side if you like um, you know that energy and that desire to want to really implement our values and then the players have took it and ran with it and, and added to it which is all we can ever ask so it's uh, it's really good yeah I've talked to a few of the girls and they were saying this is the best they've known the spirit amongst the the group would you agree with that definitely yeah it it, it sort of complements as I say probably having us really focusing in on what is it that we want our team to look like and what is it that we want to represent so we know we have a, an expectation of representing Everton Football Club but what's unique to our our Everton team and the girls have really kind of wanted to work really closely together and as I say collectively with the staff because that's the key thing if we're all on message and we all want to do the same thing which is do well this season then you know generating that team spirit is really important and you know the girls are already looking forward to we're having a, a team meal going to watch um, watch the, the men play the semi-final on Wednesday and things like that so you know it's involving everyone to understand Everton Football Club and that's what we wanted to get over very quickly and and the girls have as I say been exceptional with regards to the work and and how they've gone about it. We've seen a few girls go away on international duty which I guess has broken up pre-season a little bit but we're never going to hold them back are we? No of course not it's I think it's always a, a compliment really you know I look at the squads and and whether even that be our younger age groups as well. We've had, you know, two or three younger players from our centre of excellence get called up for the first time in under 15s camps, but more so with the, the older girls. We we see that as a huge compliment to the work that we, we do with the girls and, and the staff across all the age groups that have done with the players. So yes, it's it's one of those you think, well, we're only just into pre-season and maybe you'd want to spend as much time with the players as possible. But again, we know that international football enhances them as, as players, so it, we wouldn't want to work against that. We want to encourage it, and we know that the girls obviously are immensely proud to represent their country, so you know, it's, it's always nice for us to, to see them go away and do well.